I hope you guys are enjoying Springfest as much as I am. There are some crazy things coming up next month that I want to go ahead and share. Uh, these leaks were found by David A, so um, thank you David A for that. And uh, here we have, we're just going to go over them really quickly, I'm super excited for it and kind of want to talk about uh, what I feel might be happening a little bit in, later in the video. So here we have, as you can see, this is the Sparkle Pup. Um, and uh, this is going to be the teacher reward. Uh, this is already coded into being the teacher reward for May. So we should be seeing this as a teacher reward very, very soon. Uh, be sure to let your teachers know that this is coming and that it's not out yet. It's not out yet, but it should be on its way. So adorable, adorable uh, pet. I'm really looking forward to getting a sparkle. I haven't really, I think I've seen one one or two people with sparkles and that is it so uh, very excited for this opportunity to go ahead and snag one um, now here is the new treasure track and this treasure track is absolutely insane so for this treasure track you can see that we have access to two mythical epics we have the buzzra and then we also have this new goat the candy corn horn goats um, and so this is going to be the upcoming mythical epic, the new mythical epic, and it's going to be inside of the treasure track. So the treasure track is going to be the uh, source of obtainment for this new mythical epic. And we also have this dreamlet uh, variant down here. The dreamlet variant, you can see there's musical notes along its tail and the um, uh, appendage coming off the back looks like it is a uh, uh, a clef I believe is what they're called um, so it's it's very like musical themed the the antlers even look like it's a uh, what half a second note or something like that I think it's half a second let me know let me know um, uh, as as it sort of bends around but it has this very musical thing so instead of dreamlet I think it's gonna be called songlet it. Uh, music lit just would sound weird so song lit I think is going to be the name for it looks absolutely beautiful can't wait to see this one uh, flying around now we also have this brightly brightly colored um, uh, pet this buddy and the buddy looks perfect for summer you know the, the flowers are blooming uh, plants are growing not quite getting vegetables yet but uh, in most areas but um, they're coming soon so absolutely adorable to have this uh, pollinator as well so we actually have three pollinators and then we have the goat that's going to eat all of the plants um, <laughs> so pretty cool. I, I, it's a very interesting design. Let me know what you think about this mythical epic. Um, the, um, uh, the, the magma on the back was kind of a surprise from the head. It, it looks like there's two different styles almost kind of fighting each other. Um, the candy corn ears, horns too. I just always going to think of candy corn. Like this would be perfect for October. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, here is the treasure track. Really excited about this. Can't wait for this new mythic. Um, and also the, the Dreamlet variant looks absolutely insane. I'm glad that they're filling out the pets so that each pet, hopefully, eventually, will have its own um, alternates for all of the different elements. I think that's really, really cool. As long as, you know, we're, we're seeing new pets every once in a while as well. So um, here we go. This right here is going to be our... Um, uh, this is the... So, sorry, the wizard watch for it. So it shows a storm cloud. So we should be getting the storm cloud um, and then the song lit and then also this uh, goat guy right over here. So really excited for all of these. It actually looks like seeing this now, it looks like there might be some... Uh some multicolored lava or something like that sort of almost running down its back looks kind of like like it's uh uh touched up to look like liquid there so very interesting can't wait to see their movements can't wait to see what these look like let me know what you guys think i am really really excited for this treasure track i'm also quite excited for uh just this update as well for everyone to have the new 
uh, update here where you can go ahead and have infinite levels, have infinite levels um, of uh, gold, of resources. Hopefully this resource does change every once in a while as well. Um, I did want to quickly check though to make sure I kind of feel like I already have the uh, storm cloud. And then also, um, as I'm looking for this, uh, if we are getting uh, two mythical epics in the treasure track, this might be the last month to quest for mythical epics. The questing for mythical epics might be going away because uh, the treasure track has daily quests, weekly quests, and season quests. So we might be going, oh, that might be going away um, with that. So who knows? I'm not really 100% sure, but um, as far as questing, if you do have any questing left to do for your mythical epics, you might want to focus on that for the last five to six days before the uh, season ends. And because the treasure track is going to be wrapping up, I think it's the ends in eight days. So the 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th. Uh, don't, let's see, this is April, so 30 days. So two days after uh, April. So I wouldn't expect for there to be a Mythical Epic released uh, within the normal cycle. If there is, I'm excited. I'm uh, that's, that's exciting. But I would expect for this Mythical Epic uh, questing, as far as getting the items for the uh, different uh, pets, to sort of disappear. And then the focus of our uh, mythical epic collection just to be the treasure track and so the treasure track would be sort of the delivery system of older buddies um, cycling member buddies into um, uh, non-member collections and re-releasing old uh, and for old stuff you know different things like that so that uh, we would have access to two mythical epics just in case you you missed them on the first time around and then um, also just a bunch of other awesome awesome goodies so yeah let me know what you think about this but I really kind of feel like that's sort of the way that we're heading as far as um, uh, treasure track being the method of delivery for uh, mythical epics and also for different various uh, items I kind of like it um, I think it I think it'll be pretty cool um, the quest items you know, some of them are quite quite cool, but I think that the quest items, uh, the time spent coding them and and planning them, and uh, you know, working out what's going to go on with the mythical epics. If they take that out of their schedule, chances are we'll get a whole bunch more uh, pet variants. We'll have a whole bunch more design things going on. So I think on the end, on on the prodigy end they're going to be able to get more things out to us if treasure track does become the main vehicle for us getting mythical epics and for us getting uh you know uh the act the the ability to catch new pets so plus increasing the uh membership bang for your buck while allowing all of us to get so many more pets in our collection um that's a that that's a really really good way to go ahead and balance those two out so i think this is where we're moving i think this is the direction that we're moving into but let me know what you think in the comments i cannot wait for this uh gonna be tough sleeping for a couple days but we'll be here very very soon i'm also gonna have some stuff coming out next next uh probably next month in may um that uh hopefully you guys are going to enjoy as well working on some big projects here so um i'll be back and uh i need to finish on the connor M monster talon i believe is the name um on uh finished grinding for mythical epics on his channel as well so you'll see uh some aquadile videos coming out in a little bit uh take care keep on prodiging on guys let me know what you think about this absolutely insane have a good one all bye bye